Okay. You've been with publicists for 30 years. Uh, this has been yeah. longer. Yeah. I, I have been with publicists since uh, 1971, which is 43 40, years. 43 years. 43 years. Wow. Yeah. This tells a lot about my loyalty. Well, I people say that French are volage, so you can see that I'm not. <laughs> what about, uh, I want to know what your plans are for the next 40. Uh, next 30 only. Okay, that's it? Uh, yes. So because you've set your retirement I have been, date. I have been with publicists for 43 years, but uh, as CEO since only 1987. Okay. That's the reason why 2017, it will make uh, 30, years. 30 years. And then I will sign for another lease for 30 more years. Okay. Uh, like this, I will match uh, the time uh, of uh, Marcel Bustel Blanchet, the founder who has been uh, chairman for 60 years. Oh my God. Oh yes. Uh, you can imagine for the people working for him. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and uh, so that, like this, we will have made uh, uh, each one uh, 60 years each. That's, it could happen. It no, could, yeah. no, I'm just <laughs> kidding. So well, people should not worry about that. Uh, and the people who are in the row lining up for the succession should not worry. Good. I'll let them know. What do you think? I mean, in all seriousness, what do you foresee over the, uh, the next 30 years? What could you imagine? marketing being like, or marketing communications being like 30 years from now. Is it even possible to project forward? It, it's very difficult to project in the next, next five years because uh, I may be around uh, even if I'm no longer in charge. In 30 years, I think I will be long <laughs> gone. So therefore, I can make a lot of uh, prediction and uh, nobody will come to see me on my grave and say, you were wrong. <laughs> uh, now, there is something that we can imagine quite easily, which is uh, the alchemy of uh, technology, creativity, and um, uh, uh, science, mathematics. Uh, that's clear. We will have... Uh, incredible wealth of data. It will be more difficult than ever to reach the right person. Uh, and uh, I guess that there will be uh, uh, probably a lot of newcomers that we have no idea. We can also predict that uh, the true globalization will happen because today we are not totally global because when you look at uh, Google or Facebook, they are mainly in the Western world. Mm -hmm. There are still some big holes, China, uh, India, uh, Russia, and some other countries. Uh, so I guess that uh, the true globalization will happen. I guess also that uh, uh, the uh, white Anglo-Saxon or white Latin will be a minority in the world, a very small minority and uh, the world will be dominated by uh, Asia. Mm -hmm. That's clear. So wh what does this mean for uh, advertising? As long as brands will exist, and I think that brands will be indispensable for making the choice of the people and for helping the people to choose and also to select and to have a status according to their taste. Uh, as long as brands exist, there will be advertising because it's the only way to differentiate one brand from another. And one thing which will be paramount and complicated uh, will be to, to create the bond mm -hmm. between uh, brands and people, particularly the world which will be globalized. It will be, I don't know, more than 10 billion people, uh, which is enormous. Uh, and uh, who knows what will happen in the, in the meantime. Will it be a world of peace or shall we see more terror, more regionalism, more communism, uh, communitarism, pardon. Uh, C'est pas le communiste, mm -hmm. communitarisme. Mm -hmm. uh, 
uh, I'm translating for myself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because sometimes I'm speaking to myself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm quite familiar with myself. Yeah, the long, <laughs> yeah. See, the, but, but this begs a question of, of what kind of skill set inside? You, I mean, in a way, running a global holding company in professional services, you're a, almost like a giant HR director as well as a client services director. You're trying to match people and clients. What kind of skill sets are going to be necessary to navigate this world? The most important uh, skill set is to what we call in publicis uh, liquid talent. Hmm is uh, to be able to navigate from uh, one uh, uh, craft to another, to be able to speak digital and create in all the environment, as well as uh, to be able to speak with a client, understand the client, and to understand the technology. So it's, uh, a, a, a we, we have been fortunate, the people of my age, have been fortunate because it was r relatively easy. And uh, I, I have seen uh, uh, the, the advertising world changing and uh, it was not so complicated mm. to come up with great ideas uh, which were moving the people and building brands and moving the sales. Today, it's much more complicated <coughs> due to the numerous possibilities of communication and making sure that we are delivering the right message to the right person, which is even more complicated. At the same time, there is one thing which is quite unique in nowadays, which was a little bit uh, the, the quest for the holy grail mm -hmm. that we had, which is the feedback. Where we were uh, launching an ad, we had uh, to wait uh, for market research, for the polls, for the result uh, after the 24-hour recall and uh, a few months after, and then we were sitting down with the client and we say, oh, oh, oh we made a mistake. Well, we <laughs> have to go back to the drawing board. Or, oh, great, it worked fantastically well, but we, have not the, we had not the possibility of understanding almost immediately what is the reaction of the people, and today, this is fantastic. Uh, as soon as uh, you launch uh, an ad on the net, you kn or even on some other media like uh, TV where you can have some possibility of interactivity, you know immediately if you have reached your target or if you missed it. Yep. And that is something which is extremely important. And you can measure the investment of the client, the return on that investment. You can adjust, ad adjust the ad. You can adjust the, uh, the, the way you are uh, sending the message. Uh, so it's, uh, it, 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 it was much easier in the past. It is much more complicated today. But at the same time, there are some milestones which are helping you to do a far better job for the client. I, I, I've likened it, uh, I've likened the, uh, the role of uh, social media and these feedback loops to uh, the first time I sat behind a Bloomberg terminal or a Reuters terminal and you would see stock and bond markets move like that when news no, got really like that I yeah. had a dream to see that yeah but it's it's it's, in <laughs> it's a way. going like that yeah well that's true also easily yeah like that it's uh, okay alibaba well yeah well what about <laughs> yeah. what about what about alibaba you mentioned asia you mentioned uh, how the world is is obviously leaning more and more and more towards asia here we have one of the largest not the largest ipos in history and, uh, do you see a company like Alibaba becoming a force in the West, or is it going to be just happy uh, with the largest market on Earth? I think it's not only Alibaba. We have to think about uh, all the Chinese brands and also some uh, of the Indian brands. I believe that the first thing that they will try to do is to own their own market, mm -hmm. which is reasonable. It's a relatively sizable market. Uh, it's bigger than Europe. It's bigger than uh, uh, the US. Uh, the value is less, but uh, the value will come with the development of the economy. So it is in their own interest to own their own market in order to make sure that uh, they are blocking uh, uh, the entrance for any f foreign marketer. Mm -hmm. 
and they are doing a pretty good job at this, and then they will go outside. It is slightly more complicated for uh, the, when you look at Tencent or Alibaba, uh, because the mindset of the Chinese is very different from the uh, European, uh, the Westerners, uh, uh, or the Americans, so the Westerners. And uh, uh, when you look at uh, the way they are shopping, what they are proposing, the way they are proposing their product and uh, selling is very different from Amazon.